hello and welcome to sap learning academy and welcome to this video in this video today i'm gonna tell you with an example what is the difference between delete truncate and drop table so this question is very vital when you are appearing for an interview also for any developer who is going to do or using this uh, syntax so let me show you with an example first i want to show you a table so where i will be operating this uh, three syntax so start from so i have a table test one so first let me see the data of this table so if we just execute this now we are going to see the records so there are uh, seven records now let me describe the uh, definitions of this three syntax so uh, if i talk about delete so delete table delete from table test one so we mostly use delete syntax whenever we are using uh, or trying to delete any particular data like uh, or we can use where clause suppose delete from table delete from test one where id equal to seven so it would delete this particular record and on the other hand there are big difference between truncate and drop table and if you do truncate table then table name then it will delete the data of this table but it will not delete the structure so your structure will be uh, will be there as it is so you can uh, again insert uh, values so if you do the truncate but if you do uh, if you do the drop table then it is going to delete the data as well as the structure what you have defined so in that case you will not find the table again in your schema so for that you need to again create a new table so that's the main difference between that so let me just quickly show you with an example uh, here so first i want to show you uh, how the delete table works so let me just quickly write that so suppose i want to write like delete from test one nowhere suppose id equal to seven so that last row where the id is seven will be deleted like i'm talking about in this table so this row will be deleted so let me just quickly execute this so and uh, just uh, wait and let me rephrase the data i hope it is now deleted uh, let me check it wait yes so we can see that so that record has been deleted right so this is how we can use the delete syntax now we are going to use the truncate right so if you use the truncate t-r-u-n so if you are going to use truncate table and then table name the table name is test1 then it will delete the table it will delete the table data not the table here so so now i'm going to refresh the data this one again and we can see look there are zero records so after executing the truncate so the structure the test one table is exist but not the data so now the last one i'm going to operate that is the drop table so let's see what happens so i'm going to just uh, write here drop table drop drop so if we just now execute this one so in that case if i execute this so it there are some errors are coming so so that's uh, that it means that the structure has been deleted and this table is not exist anymore so that's all about this uh, video i hope you have understood uh, the point i wanted to raise here like the difference between delete and truncate and drop table so thank you for watching and i have a nice day and please like and subscribe my channel if you haven't done yet so thank you for watching.